Elevated troponin in and of itself does not indicate myocardial infarction. Rather, it is a sensitive and specific determinant of myocardial necrosis that is nonspecific relative to the etiology of that necrosis. Now in Jack, there is a 2012 expert consensus document on practical clinical considerations in the interpretation of troponin elevations. The review goes into great detail on all aspects of troponin use in the care of patients, and clearly there is not enough time in one heart minute to cover all the essentials. But here's the short version. Topics covered include impact of improved sensitivity troponin assays, non-ACS ischemic troponin elevations, troponins in PCI and cabbage, troponins in non-ischemic clinical conditions such as heart failure, pulmonary embolism, chronic kidney disease, sepsis, and even chemotherapy-associated cardiac toxicity. It's a big menu. This whole thing is carefully crafted and detailed, and it's a review that should be a reference for all of us who care for patients with cardiac disease. Take a look at it and download it for future use. I'm Peter Block, and this is a CardiSource Heart Minute.